I want to do another video on this because this is extremely important and this has to do with the Trump Taliban peace deal that was signed in February of 2020. All this stuff about this is how this is Biden's, President Biden's debacle. Notice that nobody is pointing this out. Now you would think and it would be very evident that the Biden administration and the left wing or the right wing media, but especially the left wing media, the democratic media, would be revealing that all of this is part of the Trump Taliban peace deal, but none of them are, not Fox News, not MSNBC, not CNN, none of what you saw as the anti-Trump media is pointing out the fact that what is occurred, what has occurred, and what is occurring in Afghanistan was all part of that Trump Taliban peace deal. Understand that, people, and what I've, I've shown in previous videos how Trump is the leader of the deep state. This is all a set up and staged event to bring him back, as I previously said. They're making sure that his hands stay clean in the matter, that he looks like he is the savior, the one and only savior, and they're using President Biden as a scapegoat. And you can understand more about the scapegoat in Leviticus chapter 16. But realize that, people. Understand what they're doing. Not one media source, not even the anti-Trump or what you believed to be the anti-Trump media is pointing out that this deal, that everything that is occurring, and I've shown that in, in previous videos, that everything that is occurring is part of the Trump Taliban peace deal. He promised to release 5,000 known, and he did, released 5,000 known Taliban terrorist prisoners, and it was an agreement with the Taliban, not the Afghanistan leadership. You can look it all up. It was part of the Abraham Accord. And this was the seven-year peace deal that is, that is mentioned in the Bible. The seven-year peace deal specifically mentioned in the Bible. The peace deal with many nations that would include Israel and many nations. But more importantly, you have to see that nobody, and I mean nobody, they're still poising in what I've shown how Trump was never their enemy. That's why they had the big jokes. All the stuff, it's, it's all been a big show, and they're keeping Donald Trump's hands clean in this matter. And you have to understand this also. <clears throat> what you see unfolding with this chaos and everything that is unfolding, no administration would be willingly be allowing this all to happen, this chaotic mess that is occurring. And what I've shown probably goes back to a year ago, that they would bring in chaos, cause complete chaos, only to bring in that Savior. You would cry out for a Savior. Save us, Donald Trump. We want Trump. But you have to spread the message, people. You have to show the videos, the proof that this was all a staged event. Remember, Donald Trump, The Art of the Deal, that was his number one selling book. When you make a deal with the devil, he always comes to collect. Understand that. Not even... Not the, the Biden administration has not pointed that out, and that's extremely important to see and realize that not even the Biden administration has pointed this out, that they are only following the peace agreement that was made by Donald Trump. 
They're not saying a word about it. They're allowing themselves to be the scapegoat. They're allowing themselves to be painted as the bad cop. This goes back to what I taught about the good cop and the bad cop. They're allowing themselves to be the bad cop so that the good cop can come in and deceive. Realize that. There's a lot of things going on right now at the same time. And uh, an administration, such as the Biden administration, you would think that they would clearly point this out, that this is not part of their debacle, that this was all part of the orchestrated peace deal that was made by Donald Trump with the Taliban. But they're not saying that. And neither is any None of the media sources, not even the supposed anti-Trump media sources, are pointing out this deal that was only back in February of 2020. This has not been three years ago or four years ago. This was recent, very recent, and not even what everybody thought was anti-Trump media is stating. Hey, people, this is, this is all Trump's deal. Biden's just following the protocol, and this whole thing is being orchestrated. And remember what the Freemasons, this is important too, what the Freemasons believe and the New World Order believes that you have to bring order out of chaos. And I've taught about that, been teaching about that. Bring order out of chaos, so they have to create that chaos in order to bring in that new world order. And that's also uh, alluded to in 2 Thessalonians chapter 2. The man of sin has to come first, that chaos, the vision, all the things that we see occurring has to be done, and then that one that comes after. There's two. When you read, and that's why it's second. Thessalonians chapter 2. The one that comes after the man of sin. Understand there's two antagonists, two main antagonists in that chapter. There's the man of sin and then the one that comes after with the, the signs and wonders. So make sure y'all are aware that they're keeping Donald Trump's hands clean in all of this so-called debacle. No administration could... You have to see that this is willfully being done. It's willfully being done so, they, that, so that they can appoint their savior. Now they're heavily invested in Donald Trump as being that savior. They can still bring back Obama, but he still he's never left any of this, if you watch my videos, he's still deeply a part of this. So they can put in place Obama still, but they're heavily invested in Donald Trump. I had to let them become heavily, heavily invested in him and see this is what you've seen over the last few years. You have Canada. You have all these many other countries, Mexico, South America, France, many places, crying out in the streets, we want Trump. And his name, as I've shown, Donald, means world leader. And that's what the Bible says. A, char a charismatic world leader would be the Antichrist. So they're heavily invested in him right now. They could change it. But you have to spread the message to make sure people understand what they're doing. Order a new world order out of chaos. That's how the Freemasons, that's their whole agenda. You have to see through the deceit, see through the lies, and see that they're making sure, even though it was all Donald Trump's deal, they're making sure to keep his hands clean in all of these matters. If this was truly about uh, the Democrats against Donald Trump, they would have, the first thing they would have done was pointed out 
and they would have been screaming it from the rooftops. Oh, no, we're just following Donald Trump's peace agreement that he made with the Taliban, but they're not doing that. Go back to my other videos and share those videos showing that Donald Trump is just as much part of the deep state as Hillary Clinton was. That's why they're best friends. That's why I showed them at their event making jokes about having her pardoned when he was trying to make everybody believe that he was going to have them all locked up. Be sure to spread the word. Spread the message, people. God bless.